Hello, my dear friends. Welcome to South Channel. I'm your old friend Eva. Today, my topic is Universal LiDAR System SAL1500. This system is composed of UAV Bravo and Laser Scanner SAL1500. Next, we will talk about the advantages of this model in eight aspects. The first the three features are about the drum, and then there are four points for the LiDAR system. The last one is for the camera. When carrying one kilogram payload, it can operate for 70 minutes. When carrying five kilograms payload, then it can hold for 50 minutes. Why we always like the long endurance UAV? Because shorter endurance will directly result in more takeoffs and landings. But moving for next takeoff sports inside the inaccessible zones seems hard or even unrealistic in most cases. After importing the relevant DM data of the serving zone, the terrain following is available. In region of large relief, it can avoid causing insufficient overlap of adjacent images. In constant ground resolution, reduce the model accuracy, aircraft collision, and other situations. With millimeter wave radar detection, the drone can detect obstacles within 60 meters ahead. And for process landing control, the downward detection distance is also within 60 meters. In terms of obstacle detection, radar technology is always more reliable than vision system. Higher intensity will enable the laser pulse to fulfill the multi-echo performance. So with this feature, we come to part 5. That is the most unique part. The LiDAR achieves 7 returns per laser pulse. Multi-echo technology of scanner sensor enjoys higher possibility of penetrating the gaps between tree branches and leaves and reaching the bare earth surface finally. For example, the first the echo of one laser beam comes from the canopy, the second from tree branch, the third from a certain leaf, then the fourth or even the fifth reaches the ground and obtains one effective measurement for DEM data. Longer wavelength will enable the laser scanner to work at a higher frequency, which allows longer detecting range and enjoys better penetrability of ring and smog. In other words, LiDAR with 1550 nanometers is more suitable to work against the humid environments like forest and jungle. Smaller field of view will result in smaller scan coverage in practice. Fix the perspectives might restrict the scan's area on the ground. With longer field of view, the area efficiency goes up. Higher resolution of image sensor allows higher aptitude in flat setting and enjoys bigger photograph coverage while maintaining the same ground sampling distance of images or achieves better ground sampling distance value while keeping the same flight altitude. So for SAL1500, the LiDAR mount on a multi-rotor UAV. Comparably, the cost is friendly and mostly used for small areas that are considerably elevated and inaccessible. However, we still have multiple options. Fly with a VTOL fixed wing drum for longer endurance normally can provide up to 2 to 6 hours. Or fly with a manned aircraft to challenge those much bigger mission zones with complex terrain and dense vegetation. Drive when it's possible, mostly used for road expansion or reconstruction topography and road asset inventory. Okay, so much for today. Seeing is believing. Welcome to our customers to inquire. See you next video.